Hello everybody, this is Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePix.com and author of the MoviePix.com Guide to Adobe Photoshop Elements and Adobe Premiere Elements. And here we are in Photoshop Elements 2022, looking at some of the new features. Now, in the last version of Photoshop, under the Enhance menu, Adobe added a nice little tool called Moving Photos, which created sort of a 3D look of motion for your photos. In this generation, they've added something called Moving Overlays. Kind of nice, we take a still photo and we add animations to it. And these overlays include things like stars and hearts and falling leaves and snow. There are also graphics like butterflies and balloons, fire, these are all animated. I personally am a big fan of the frames and we can select a frame from the library here and I'm just gonna select this frame here. It'll take a second for it to overlay onto the picture. Once it overlays, I can resize it just by pulling on the little corner handles here on the side and on the top. Now this is animated. We'll look at the animation here in just a moment, but I also want to show you a really cool trick. Uh, let's go ahead and click the check mark here to lock in that resizing of the frame. You notice there's an option here for protect subject. And when I click on this, Look what happens. The program automatically finds the people in the picture and makes the frame appear behind them, between the picture and the background. That's pretty cool. And if I click on the play button, you can see indeed it is animated and there is fire and there is ice and there are different colors, a lot of really nice graphics you can overlay. Once it's done, you have the option to export it. And if you click on the export button here, you have the option of exporting it as an MP4. An MP4 will give you just a sort of five second animation. But if you select the option for GIF here, you get a nice animated GIF. Let's go ahead and save it here and we'll call it frame. There we go. And we'll save that under maximum quality. And if I locate that file and click on it, you can see that we get the animation and since it's an animated GIF rather than an MP4, it's continuous. So I can load that up to my Facebook or my Instagram or whatever. And I get this really nice continuous animation through the picture. Very nice. It's a cool way to take a still photo and turn it into something with a little bit more motion and excitement, a little more dynamic. And it couldn't be easier here in Photoshop Elements 2022. Now, if you want to know more about this feature, all the new features and all the old features, be sure and check out our book, The MoviePix.com Guide to Photoshop Elements. It's available at Amazon.com or check out the many tips and tutorials we have at MoviePix.com. I'm Steve Grizzetti. I'm the author and I hope to see you again real soon.